Hi everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play... Sorry. Welcome back to Let's Play Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. Last time we left off, we just started Turnabout Samurai. And this is our client, Will Powers. So now we're going to go and move over to... Uh... The studio. I can't think of the studio name now. <laughs> Anyways, get ready, folks, to meet the annoyingest person in this case. And I think both in practically the whole game. And maybe the series. I don't know. I'll let you guys decide that. So, let's go to Gatewater Studio. I think that's what it is. Global Studios. Wow! This is where they sh make the Steel Samurai show? Awesome! Aren't you excited? Hey! You there! You want in? You gotta go through me! Oh, s sorry! We're, um, lawyers! Oh, yeah? Oh, that's great! I'm security! Meet Wendy Oldback. The most annoyingest security guard you'll ever meet. Ah. Uh, let's see if I can do a good voice for her. My job is to make sure you cockwalkers stay out. Cockwalker. Cockers, cockers, sorry. Cockers, sightseers, Doris. You know the type. I know the type. You heard about the incident that came to stoop around. Huge today. So, I'm gonna. Ugh. Yep, and this is why she's annoying. Sorry, folks, but bitch, bitch, nag, 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 bitch. Um, um, Nick. Will I grow up to be like her? Please say no. Uh, I don't know. It's possible. Hey! Listen to when you're spoke to. You use these days! Yeah, um... Wendy Oldbeck. Ladies and gentlemen. Here, let's show her my attorney's badge. What's that? Are you giving it to me? Um, absolutely not! Just showing that you're my... Oh my god, it's good. Ugh. The studio. So, what did... So, what do you do here at the studios? Global Studios? We make killer screams come true! In fact, in my younger days... Hold on, folks, I'll be right Okay, everyone, I'm back. In fact... In fact... In my day... My younger days... No. You, no, you were a star? Only a little twinkle between the stars here. I'm afraid, dearie. Ooh, ooh, wow. wow. This place has really gone downhill, you know. I can't do a naggy voice. Sorry. But in my ten years ago, but ten years ago, that was, there was a, that was the studio of dreams! Hammer was a big star back then, too. He was... Hammer? The victim, dummy! The evil magistrate! He's been... He's been reduced to playing villain now. Not exactly the best material to work with. I could disagree with that, miss. Can you tell me about Will Powers? He's not a bad kid, but don't be fooled by his mask. You, you wouldn't want him on the silver screen without it. Believe me! Little old ladies watching will lose their lunch. That's probably why he thought that the, big, the Steel Samurai was his big chance. No one thought he was capable of doing what he did to poor Jack Hammer. We don't know if he... We don't know it, for certain that Will Powers is guilty. Powers? Of course he's guilty! 
How do I know? I know everything! That's my job! Mr. Hammer. What kind of person was Jack Hammer? What kind of person? Oh, only if you only knew. Jack Hammer will, will live on in many hearts as the ultimate action hero. He was simply dashing in a Dynamite Samurai series. Should I have heard of that? But there was an accident during filming five years ago. He got an unlucky break after that. Reduced to playing the villain on a children's program. What's more, I heard they were paying him peanuts. It's enough to make you cry. Ugh, I hate this lady. I wish I could do a better naggy voice, but it's the best I can do. Why are you so certain Powers is the killer? I was standing right here yesterday, I was. I was here from... I was here from 1 in the afternoon to, to 5 when they found the body. Now, studi now the studio where the murder took place is to the left of here. So if you want to go to the studio, you'll have to get passed by me. The only person went there between 1 and 2.30 when the murder took place. And that person was Mr. Powers? Yes, I saw him. But Mr. Powers said he was sleeping in his dressing room. Oh, I'm sure he said that. He's no fool, but he was the only one. One that walked by. He's the killer. You can bet your biscuits on it. Isn't it about time for you to be heading home? There's nothing to see here. Move along. Um, actually, we're here at Mr. Power's request. So get out of the way, old bag. Huh, I thought you were suspicious looking. Show me a letter of request, and maybe I'll just let you in. This lady here thinks she, she owns the place, obviously. Ugh. Here, would this do? My attorney's badge. Ugh. Oh, I'll be right back. Okay, everyone, I'm back. Sorry about, about it. I'm doing like two things at once around here. I got a show going on and I'm doing this. Oh boy. Live, live and learn, I guess. Anyways. Well, now we go back to the detention center and talk with Will Powers and see if we can get a... Get a letter of request. Hello. How was the studio? They think I did it, didn't they? N no, not at all. Isn't that... <gasps> Isn't that right, Nick? Right, not at all. At worst, you're a suspect. <laughs> Your alibi. Mr. Po Mr. Powers, aren't you... You aren't hiding from me, aren't you? Are you? What? No, no, I would never do that. Just now, you asked... Just now... Just now, you said that you were sleeping in your dressing room after lunch. Yes, like a baby. But the security lady said that she saw you that day. She says that she saw you heading toward the scene of the crime. What? That's not possible. I... I really don't know what to say. I was sleeping. I promise. Mr. Powers, if you want me to help you, you have to tell me the truth. I am new to this lawyer business, and I need every advantage I can get. I know. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> but I swear to you, on my mama's grave, I was sleeping. Maybe the security lady only thought she saw me. What did she see? He doesn't even... He doesn't seem to be lying. The security lady. Um, about the security guard at the main gate to the studios. Oh, the security lady? She's terrible. She called me suspicious looking. Oh, sorry, that was Maya. My bad. Yes, actually, she said the same thing to me before. Take off that mask. Actually, that's a good, that's a good one for the security lady, so... 
take off that ma mask. Mask were her words, I believe. Hmm. Take off her. Take off that mask. Were the words I believe. She sucks up to all the big wigs at no. She sucks up to all the big wigs at the studio. At least let, but let her see you stumble. At least let you. At least let, but let her see you stumble once, and she'll never let let up on you. Sorry, I got you some voices over, but her, she's got some nerve. Do you think you could write write up a letter of formality request? Requesting my reputation? Uh, uh, of course. I just hope this will get past the scary lady. Here. You wanted a Powers Letter? Here's Powers Letter. Ma'am, have a look at this. It's a letter of request from Mr. Powers. Yes, yes. I recognize that bold childish snob. Powers request gave to the scary lady. To think that he was entrusted his fate to youth of such unreliable appearance. Really? 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 Anyways, you may pass, but only left from here toward the studio. No going to the right. That's the employee's area. No one's allowed inside, pal. Where are my instructions? I'll be Okay, everyone, I'm back. The good detective told me, told me himself. Hey, 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 Nick. Huh? There were, there were maps in the security guard station. Hey, not bad. Those are 50 cents a piece, thank you. Well, time to go, Nick. 50 cents! We just saw a guide, guide map. Ha <laughs> Bio bag. Let's move outside to Studio One. Hey! Aren't you the troublemaker from the other day? Ah! It's a confused detective! Hey, pal! You know Prosecutor Edward is all upset. It's your fault! I saw him sipping tea, staring gloomy outside the window. Um, so? Hey! Hey! If he's suppressed, it's all your fault for not doing- for doing the slapping detective work. Um, um, detective? I think you hurt his feelings. Oh no, I- I'm sorry. Well, well, I think his earnings are are easily hurt. You're right, pal. It's my fault. I can blame other people all I want, but I know the truth hurts my heart. Hey, hey, don't take it so hard. There's always ne the next case. Hey, yeah, I suppose you're right. Hey, what exactly are you two doing here? Um, well, we're on this case too, pal. Hey! No, we... Uh, sorry, sorry, I can't... That does not fit Gumshoe, I'm sorry. If I, if that's the voice I used since the beginning, I'm sorry, but I gotta change it. There's no way I can use that. Hey! You can't, you can't just go and saying the word pal like that. That's my endering character trait. I say he's a character, alright. Anyways, we'll talk to Gumshoe in the next video. Sorry for this video being short, folks, but um, I just want to try to get another video all done done tonight. So, and I'm also watching the TV show. So, um, next time we'll go and talk to Gumshoe and and try to get some information out. So, see you guys next time on Let's Play Phoenix Wright: Ace Attorney.